Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. So today I'm so 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 excited because I finally got my hands on the Huda palette. Yay! Thanks to my hubby because I tried purchasing this online, I wasn't able to and then it was sold out, I was like so upset and then um, Dubai Mall finally launched it yesterday and my hubby just happened to be there and I called him and he just dropped down to Sephora and purchased it for me. Okay so let's talk about packaging first. I love the... I love this whole thing that she has going, this metallic eyes thing and it's basically a cardboard box and it slides open like this yep you see that and you open it and and this is what the eyeshadows look like They're beautiful, beautiful, gorgeous eyeshadows. Okay, the palette is magnetic. It's basically a cardboard palette. Now, I actually like the palette. I like the fact that you can see the eyeshadows. Um, I think it's just something different because usually, normally, all eyeshadow palettes either have something going on on top, but I actually like the palette. Yeah, it looks quite nice. I mean, I like the fact that I can see all the eyeshadows. Okay, so I purchased this from Dubai Mall yesterday and the palette's retailing here for 250 dirhams. How about on the website? I believe it's about $68 plus uh, shipping. I believe on her website right now it's already sold out. So this is a limited edition palette, so if you do want to buy this, um, you either need to go down to Sephora and Dubai Mall and I think they will be launching this uh, this Sunday in Abu Dhabi in Yas Mall. So all you guys who live in Abu Dhabi drop down to Yas Mall on Sunday and you will be able to buy this palette then. Okay, so now let's get down to business. Yep. Now this palette has about 18 eyeshadows in here. So 18 eyeshadows for 250 dirhams is not bad actually because you know in Dubai we are used to paying more than 230 dirhams for any palette, any kind of palette, you know, uh, Urban Decay, uh, Too Faced, whatever brand it might be, it's usually above 230, 40 dirhams, so 250 dirhams and you get about 18 shadows which is of great great quality so I don't think that's pretty bad I think the pricing on this is actually pretty good because it is pretty difficult to put out a palette so out of these 18 shadows we have six metallic the 3d metallic eyeshadows and two shimmery eyeshadows so everything that you see from here to here these are all your 3D metal shadows and these two, they are your shimmery eyeshadows and the rest, they're all matte up here. They're all matte. Okay. Now, the 3D metal shadows, let's talk about the 3D metal shadows. They are pretty good. It does have this weird texture to it. It's something different. I've never tried an eyeshadow which is quite like this. I mean, I don't know if you can see that. There's this texture thing going on over here. So, okay. Now, in the beginning, um, I was really desperate. I really wanted to buy this palette. I wasn't able to buy it. It got sold out on their website. And then the videos and the reviews started to come in. And there was a lot of negativity about, the, um, about this palette. Um, that it didn't swatch really very well the price point was too high shipping was expensive and I was pretty disappointed at first and then I saw some more reviews directions apply gently around the eyes with a brush foiled textures deliver their maximum payoff when applied with fingertips so yeah 
uh, however I still did use um, a brush and I used a little bit of MAC Fix Plus and it applied really well however I did use my fingertips to apply uh, one of the other shadows just over here just to give it a little bit a little bit more of that pop however yeah you do get better color payoff when you use your fingers for the metal shade now let's get down to the matte shades okay the matte shades I saw like million swatches where everybody was like oh it's not swatching very well I'm disappointed blah 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 okay matte shades are usually very difficult to formulate and this is a uh, talc free this is 100% talc free now MAC shadows the matte MAC shadows are exactly the same because when you swatch any of the MAC shadows it doesn't swatch very well but however the moment you put it on your lids with a brush it's just like boom so I'm just gonna come a little bit closer I've got um, pink flamingo and sandalwood in my crease okay and i did use a primer but just one swipe and the color payoff is pretty amazing i mean you could just see and i've got um i've used a dubai because hey dubai i had to use dubai <laughs> so i used dubai and on my lids and i used a little bit of 24k um i'm just gonna show you this is dubai this is 24K. I used a Dubai on my lids and just a little bit of 24K, just like in the middle. And I've used Flamingo and Sandalwood in my crease. And I believe I used a little bit of Cocoa as well. Yeah, I used a little bit of Cocoa as well in my crease just to give it a little bit more of depth. I have nothing bad to say about this palette. I mean, for the price, it is pretty good. I mean the shadows are great um, the color pigmentation of the matte shadows are also pretty good uh, Huda did a pretty good job with this palette um, just like her liquid lipstick and her lashes and I love love the fact that she put in black and this particular cool tone shade I mean it's just perfect it's just perfect you can take this with you anywhere so my take on these shadows, the blendability is great, um, the color pigmentation is great, I think the price point is pretty good for the amount of products that you're getting in here. So if you haven't bought this yet, go and buy yourself one of these palettes because yeah, you need this. I mean, just look at it. Just look at how gorgeous this is. Just look at how gorgeous this is. I'm so so glad my hubby picked this up for me and uh, the weight of this shadow is it, sorry it weighs about 18 grams which is like uh, 0.63 ounces so yeah so if you did enjoy watching this video please do like and subscribe to my channel and I will be inserting a clip after this video of all the swatches so you can see the swatches for yourself